Hello. Welcome everyone! We are the Grin Brothers and we're continuing our playthrough of Fallout 4's DLC. I wonder what you, how you and the <clears throat> people would react if I just cut that out. <laughs> well, the last time that I didn't do an intro like that, HP did complain saying that everything is wrong and nothing is right in this world anymore. I should just like constantly cut it out. Or like, <laughs> just put in like the first half and cut it out. <laughs> just put in the first half and cut out the rest of the video. Yeah. Just... Welcome everyone! Or just put it like at the end of the video. I don't know. <clears throat> That'd be weird. Well, this is a fun game. Oh! Oh, there we go. Hello, you told Kiri. Me, hello, Kiri. So, we've got oh, ourselves no, our you. medic yep. for our party. Let's um, go to Gangsterland. That's where we're going, isn't it? Yes, to actually finally uh, start doing some of the DLC. Heresy! Uh. Why is my inventory like full? Which is strange because I thought you unloaded it before you got about here. It's not like you'd have gotten much of any use from those uh, thugs you just killed. I'm trying to figure out what's weighing me down, is it? It's probably an excess of meat. No. Junk. <clears throat> Oh no, it's all this. Oh you Oh oh yeah, no. we killed a lot of them in uh the vault, didn't we? Well it's well, not a problem, we can uh, you're not over encumbered, are you? You can just walk back, unload, and then walk to where you need to go. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. <clears throat> yeah. You know, I've I've somehow gotten myself a cold yet again. Not nearly as bad as the last one I had. The last one I had gave me a right pounding headache. This one's just making me sniffly. Mm. Gave me a bit of a... Uh, Unclear, right? It's not even like it's a sore throat. It just feels like I can't talk properly. Mm. Um, and you know what? I never used to have this happen. I never used to get colds cold so frequently or ill like this. When I ate how I used to. I've only started doing this ever since I started my diet. That I've started to feel blame, worse and worse. You can't worse. blame healthy food for Apparently, everything in the world. You know, I should go back to having dessert, having meat and such for lunch and microwave pizzas having uh, New Yorker dripping and melted cheese as a drink and slurping it up extra portions because that made me healthy I don't think it did no no it, it clearly did because I never used to get this ill and I have been ill constantly since I stopped my diet started my diet yeah I don't think that's how that works it's correlation, Raph. Correlation. Yeah. <coughs> Where? I know we've got some in here. Does miscellaneous add any weight? No, but... Medicine bubblehead. Melee bubblehead. They're still active whilst they're there, aren't they? Mm-hmm. <sighs> this stuff is just really annoying. <clears throat> the apocalypse happened and still there are collectibles. You still have the ability to nerd out. Yeah, when you expect. <clears throat> basically, I'm just tidying up. Yeah, that's basically what you're doing at the moment. Yeah. It's strange because the opening, that opening sort of hub menu is so loud and then you get to the game and it's like... Where the clicking of the D-pad is probably louder, and yeah. I guarantee it's being picked up. <clears throat> what? 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 It's full. I have to make another one. Furniture. Oh, the horror! The horror, indeed. Containers, I guess. <clears throat> so let's see. Uh, well, there's a short thing to mention. Um, in Japan. There has been a shortage of the video game fitness boxing. Okay. Uh, for the Nintendo Switch. A Nintendo IP that not many people know about. P Pommel Horse? So, you know, really, we just got to count the days until Sakurai stops adding all Wait, these third pie characters and decide to add fitness boxing trainer into Smash Brothers. As an echo of Wii Fit Trainer. Frankly, I'd take... You know, frankly, I've gone to the stage I'd even take Waluigi at this point if to avoid... Some of these uh, weaker choices of characters. What? 
I mean, not that we need another Mario character. Apparently, Sakurai has gone to the extent of adding random minions. When we heard the entire Pokemon series to do just that. We haven't figured out Piranha Plant, so... He's out. He's interesting. I'm fairly sure he can't fly. That's a that's a new thing. And frankly, if Piranha Plants would like that in a Mario game, Mario would be getting his ass handed to him. It'd be kind of terrifying, wouldn't it? <clears throat> Why can I build meat bags? Why can I build half the stuff? It doesn't do anything. An espresso machine? I don't know, machine? maybe they were planning a super mutant settlement. Where's... That'd actually be pretty cool, honestly. <coughs> oh, they're in shelves. Yes. Because that's a shelf, everyone. Well, magazine rack. Yeah, apparently. God. Well, it serves the same purpose. Kind of doesn't. Because I'm uh. only able to put... You know, magazines uh. in it. It's storage. Uh. Um, well, technically you store stuff on a shelf. Yeah, you can't actually do that in this game. Well, aren't they already stored with your magazines there? Yeah, but you, the actual shelves, you can't technically store stuff. You put stuff on it, but you don't store it in it. That's weird. <coughs> but once this is done, it means we won't have as much junk is our inventory, okay. so if I need to go through and find something like I did on that other episode. Yeah, it'll be a lot easier. Yeah, um, but fitness boxing, apparently in Japan, some people started talking online about their weight loss stories, uh, and so there suddenly became a huge influx of people buying fitness boxing, amazing. because of course, you know, New Year's resolutions always tend to be lose weight. Nintendo knew what they were doing when they released it <clears> this time. Yeah, December 26th. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, no, uh, I think we in the UK are going December 14th. I did consider f getting fitness boxing because it's a obscure as heck Nintendo IP and I thought, hey, it could be fun. But then I saw the music selection and oh my gosh, the music choices were awful. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, heck, you're boxing. You'd think there'd be some more action-packed music to go with it. But no. One pound! <clears throat> That's terrible. I'm never going to do that again. Turn that off. Oh, God. I forgot Ada's... Well, that's not even Ada. It's Curie. Curie, yeah. You, you, you uh, altered machine. Curie a little bit. <coughs> God, it's amazing that this food hasn't gone out of date. Or some drugs and oh them. man, that would suck if you uh, if all the food had the chance of going out of date. Happens in um seventy six. Really? Yeah. Oh wait, I wasn't supposed to talk about that. Oh, that's a shame. Well, yeah, it's it's technically a Bethesda game. We're allowed to talk about Fallout seventy six. No. I literally have a category, a subject here called so Bethesda, you, which no. became a catchphrase for me because of how often I mentioned it to Kiris. I'd just... go up to him each day and it goes, So, Bethesda? Sure, but he do. And it'd just be a new thing that Bethesda has apparently screwed up with. <coughs> These are cute little pins. They are. <coughs> I think they made some of them as actual things, but. <coughs> well, as actual pins you can buy. Uh, but not all of them. Because it's Bethesda and they never finish anything. Yeah, we've got their video games as proof. Apparently, um... Anthem had a beta released. Oh, the EA game, yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. just a broken mess. That's really? That's not playable at the moment. That's what I've heard. Anything you know in particular happened with it? Because I heard... No, I didn't really look into it. it much. Because, like... Yeah. So here's the thing. I didn't actually know what Anthem was. Oh, I've, I know about it because of the EA trailer, because of trailers at EA's E3 conference. And I was like, well, I guess I should probably know because it's kind of my job <clears throat> to. So, so I went to my boss. I was like, cool. So, um, what actually is Anthem? <clears throat> and the way he tried to pitch it to me is, it's like Destiny, but made by EA. <clears throat> and I said, you have just done a perfect <coughs> job of making me not want to buy that. 
so right, hold see. on. Which uh, which building complex should we go to first? This one, this one, that one, that one, or that one? I don't remember what's in any of these. Uh, let's go to Square Town. That one? Yes. Because there's like two squares. But we'll go here. I think that's the Magic Kingdom. Interesting. Which means <sighs> I'm going to need a lot of right away. Um, oh yeah, so that's Space World. But yeah, basically, uh, Anthem is made by Bioware. Um, yeah. And it's a big sort of uh, floral planet thing. You've got jetpacks and giant mecha suits you can uh, obtain, but they can get damaged. They have to go back for repairs. And it's online. Uh, I'm not sure if it's entirely online, but it's heavily online focused. Um, and you shoot things with RPG mechanics. So it's, it, it is EA's destiny. Basically. Cool. Yeah. Uh, I guess another game example, if you needed something else, uh, Division, EA's Division. That is doing an even worse job of selling me on it. Uh, EA's Fallout 76. <laughs> <coughs> this is just going downhill. <laughs> um... It look it visually it looks lovely because it's actually got colour to it. Is that where yeah v very nice to look at. So um, uh, but it was a heavy shooter focus, so of course it had no interest for me. This could be interesting because I know for a fact Yeah. This place uh has bugs in it. Bugs? Yeah, as in like game bugs, not bug bugs. Oh, okay. Because in my playthrough I physically cannot finish the <laughs> world. What? <laughs> because the I quest... Thought you, I thought you had completed No, I can't finish that, sorry. <clears throat> How come? Because it glitched. So I can't... I... Oh, let's walk to it first. I, I couldn't finish the quest line in there because the guy doesn't spawn. Oh. So... What, well, Wizard Town? Yeah. Like, I got so far into it <clears throat> that I apparently, um... Broke it. Wow. So, I mean, hopefully it's patched out, but it's Bethesda, so it's not patched out. Kitty Kingdom? Yep. So, not Magic Kingdom? It's Magic Kingdom. Oh. Well, it's Kitty Kingdom. Yeah, it's, it's full of magic. And wonder. And radiation. So, by magic, you mean radiation? So... Oh, that'd be interesting. What if it's a, ga a ghoul gang? Uh... Or if there were a ghoul gang... Because that'd be a really cool idea, because you get all the ghouls, and they're either feral or they're citizens who really don't want to be killed. Do I equip the hazmat suit? Oh, D equips everything. Well, we're not attacking anything yet, so... We're going to be. Oh. Ugh. Why is the destroyer's home? Charisma and intelligence. Now, you wouldn't think something with destroyer in its tail would be... Uh... Charismatic, but hey ho. <laughs> Blocking? <laughs> wow. That's just my phone. Oh, okay. Um, um, I am going to. But yeah, it's, it's basically being seen as uh, Bioware's last chance. Throw it down. Well, that do. Well, Neo Bioware. Oh, hold on. I'm being phoned by someone who I actually recognise. Okay, uh, shall I interrupt? Yeah. Okay, interruption time! And we are back after the interruption. Okay, so we came here and they want to kill us immediately? Yeah. If we became, like, the head of the honcho, I'm assuming if we enter here, they wouldn't try to kill us straight away? No, they would. These oh. guys are not affiliated with the Raiders. Oh. They just happen to live there? Yeah. This is... their home. <clears throat> we, we've barely done anything! Yeah, so, if the nicest person in the world can still see you as a kid, then I'm perfectly allowed to still kill you Raffi, my baby brother. Uh... No, that's the thing. She doesn't see me as a kid anymore. <laughs> In fact, she said she never saw me as a child because I was apparently 
mature. That's only because you constantly sound like you need a lozenge. No, I sound clinically depressed as a difference. <clears throat> Yeah. So, Kieran, also, never, your touch, never uh, touch me again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh, Dad, now I'm bucking, get radiated you. Kiri, can have you considered attacking? There are things around her. Like this guy. Okay, I can see what you mean, Rafi, about the bugs. Oh, no, that's just full right. <laughs> I'll take him out of my psychic bat. Psychic, because the hit animation didn't load. Look at him dance. I'm not sure if the Look ghouls were dark. designed to move like that, or whether Professor just messed up the animation to sort of just keep it that way. Is someone shooting at me? Perhaps we should have given Kiri guns. They have guns! Oh no, it's a turret. I was going to say, the ghouls do not have guns. I think the dogs are looking the bag. Your cat does that. He'll look plastic like carry my bag or... I don't know. Well, my bag's not made of plastic. It does have my retro gamer in, so I really hope they're not looking at it. Oh, they're licking something. They might be trying to get to the lunchbox in there. I'm going to go sort that out quickly then. You do that. Ow. <clears throat> um. No, they were just licking the plastic bag. Oh, the enemy so it's in my bag. Because I make sure the Why is everything so dangerous here? The rain cannot get to any of my stuff, if at all. Yeah, I don't know why the animals seem to lick plastic <coughs> bags. Because you can't... Oh, it's, it. um... Apparently, like, uh... Well, for cats, apparently bags are a de-stressing method. Okay. They lick bags to de-stress themselves. Right. Could be the same for dogs. Vanilla, quiet. Yeah, I, uh... God damn it. I'm not sure why I brought up fitness boxing, because I don't have anything else I can really mention about it. Was over that. It was a very short mention. I mean, um, I've done that before. I wouldn't fret about it. But it was, it was a game I just considered getting in, because, I, you know, last year, all my games got delayed. Much like this year, where all my games have been delayed. I think the dogs are trying to get in. Oh, money. They do seem to be trying to get in. Oh it's God. strange. I'm sure Mum fed them this morning. Probably did. Yeah. I'm Whoa. sure she told me that. Hey, shut up! Shut them out of the front room so they shouldn't be barking. Because they were barking constantly in there. They'll bark anyway. Oh. The big boy bark. I've laid him well. outside so they don't need to go to the toilet. Uh -huh, Susie, I think, peed upstairs. Gosh, already? That's usually why they go upstairs. I had the back door open for ages! Yeah. And they usually don't mind the cold. Usually it's the rain that they don't go outside for. Manila! So is it mostly ghouls you're attack you're fighting here? It's pretty much just ghouls. It's it's um. So is it what just one guy seeing in a hut as ghouls are surrounded by the place? It's because the radiation, everything's been ghouled. Ah, oh, it hurts you. You can't ride it. I tried jumping over it. <clears throat> also, these people have an obsession with uh, just. Talking. Sending you through death valleys and then talking constantly about it. Is that a legendary with no hands? Yeah, I broke his hands. Oh, they, okay. I thought you meant yeah, they were already. I thought they were already broken. Yeah, it doesn't really uh, do much when it. Uh... <laughs> oh, that's hilarious! A guy with no arms had a cryogenic male alarm. That sounds funny. Um, yeah, so, the, this guy makes sense why he, um, locks himself away because everything's radiated, talks constantly to you, are you, oh, that's curious, I was about to say, is that immune suicider? Um, no, you'd hear the beeping, 
If I saw the gl- yeah, well, I just assume that bugged out. So, I'm assuming we'll find the guy soon enough, so we'll find. Uh, so I'll be see what you mean. I, I just want to be very cautious about the order that this is done. In case you break something. Uh, yeah, in case I get sequence broke. Oh god. Hold on, I'm just gonna look it up quickly. That's uh, okay. Um, four out. Four. Uh, let's see here, something to talk about here. Uh, I don't really have anything to talk about here in a short amount of time. Uh, there is one thing I can mention, actually. Um, I believe I brought up before about the carrot I won at a raffle, Pale Rose. And uh, I made a journal post recently uh, on DeviantArt because I wanted to uh, give a few shout-outs to people who had organised uh, raffles that I happened to watch. Uh, Shimei Eiko had a raffle, uh, Yukiochi had an adopt raffle going on, and um, Luveri Uc had a raffle going on. So I decided to make a, a post dedicated to give a shout out to all of them. There's a few other people who uh, had uh, some, like, commissions open for various reasons. Frikyo who had some emergency commissions. Uh, <coughs> Eiju Aiko who's wanting to get uh, core again, so who has commissions open. And uh, a deviant artist that I've uh, started watching recently, Mega Bunny, uh, is in a situation where she could do with a bit more money as well. So she's opened up a commission. So I gave a shout out to a lot of people in it. But I also thought, well, on deviant art, that might as well be a good opportunity to talk about the fact that I adopted a character recently in the form of Pear Rose. And uh, much to my surprise, not just one day after I made that journal post, Freakio. Gave me a gift in the form of drawing a full body picture of Pale Rose. Huh. Didn't ask or anything. I said that I'd pla- I had plans to commission a full body picture of her at some point. But I was expecting it probably would be even towards the end of the year. Or until I get a full time job where I've got more spare money that I could spend on things outside of the Grim Brothers stuff. You know, more... Because Pale Rose is more of a... Just a for fun character to draw have drawn. Rather than... Nanker and Hat, which promotes the Grim Brothers channel. And whose artworks are more likely to be used in these videos. Um, so getting this sort of free drawing, and a really detailed one, was a pleasant surprise. Really nice. <clears throat> As always, I'll see about asking if I can have it uh, thrown up on screen. Um... Yeah, uh, Freakio is in need of uh, commissions at right. the moment. Uh, so I've been talking with Freakio about uh, doing... Because Freakio's got such ridiculously cheap prices, I figured I could do a, another quick commission because after a little spending thing... Well, actually, that's another thing to quickly bring up. Uh, I had to do a really weird payment method for the... Um, uh, uh, for one of the commissions recently. Where, in order to pay the person, I had to send them PS4 gift cards. It definitely wasn't what I'd expected, but hey-ho. Yeah, apparently... Does the job. Uh, PS4 gift cards are weirdly expensive uh, in Latvia. Um, so, we were asked to buy PS4 gift cards and send the codes over as payment for the raffle commission. Um... Oh so, my god, man, shut up. <clears throat> so, uh, that's, that's how we've decided to pay him. But as a result, I haven't actually used up some of the money, the sort of like 89 quid in the uh, Grin Brothers uh, bank account that I was actually going to use to um, pay the person with. Hmm. So I do have a bit more money from the get-go in the Grin Brothers account. I mean, technically, it's still a lot of money because the money I had out at the time... Uh, it was me getting 60 quid early to pay for uh, board. Yeah. I mean, it turns out with this week, because I'm having Wednesday off, I'm not going to have to pay board anyway, because I only pay board every five days of work I get. And then I give uh, mum one day's worth of pay, so about 60 plus quid. Well, right. we always just 60 quid, so mum doesn't have constant little pound coins. Because it's not like any of the cash machines, you know, disperse pound coins. It'd be neat if they did, but they don't. Right leg, right <clears throat> arm, left arm. Um, I want to replace that. Yeah, as a result of that, um, you know, I have this excess money, 
And because uh, Freakio is quite affordable, I'm probably going to do a quick commission from Freakio again. Weirdly enough, the most likely commission that's going to get done through Freakio is a Christmas commission. Okay. Because... Why is uh, Christmas weird? Because it's not Christmas. Or even close to Christmas at the moment. Yeah, I guess that's a fair point. But basically, I was commissioning Freakio for a Christmas commission involving hat yeah. at around Christmas time. But uh, matters came up, which I never asked about because it seemed personal, uh, where Freakio couldn't do any commissions all of a sudden. Yeah. And I had to put them on hold. Um, but now that Freakio is looking for commissions again, I, you know, I never actually paid Freakio at the time because we were still in the sketch phase. Yeah. Um, but if Freakio is looking for commissions, we may be finishing that off. So a Christmas commission in like February slash March. Makes sense. We did Halloween in January, so... Yeah! Oh, we're, we're messing up all the holidays. Yep. Uh, I think we... Considering this is a second part to an already finished... Uh, to an already recorded part, I think that's about time. Uh, yeah. I... Oh, that didn't heal me. Oh. Leveling up didn't heal you? No. Oh, I hope someone can find the uh, corpse of Ferret to bury right, it's what is saving. 